So I wanted to sit down and chat with you all about this controversy in the online space of fasted training for women, whether you should do it, whether it's going to destroy your hormones, who should definitely avoid it, all that stuff. And you know, originally I was sitting down today and I was going to make a Instagram swipe post on this. And the more and more I thought about the nuance and the layers and the angles of this topic of conversation, I thought it it deserves much more being a piece of long form content than a short form debunk snippet type thing that we see in the online space and or that loses the nuance of the conversations. When we say fasted exercise, what do we mean? So essentially you are going into a training session after an overnight fast. So you woke up in the morning and you don't consume any calories going into that training session and your body is fully depleted of glycogen and or glucose stores in your body. Now it might not be 100% depleted depending on what you eat for dinner the night before and or your normal training state, but typically it is lower in the morning in your liver and or muscles just again, depending on your nutritional state and going into that. So the idea behind fasted training or the reason a lot of people do it are either one, you wake up early, you're busy, you want to just get into training, you feel like you don't have time to eat and you just want to hop into it and get it done with. 